Hi, this is just a quick walkthrough video on uh, what to do when a student leaves your class and transfers out of your class and goes to another class or leaves the school. So what will happen uh, the night of uh, that transfer is the student will drop out of your gradebook. So what we want to do first is go to our gradebook and then uh, where it says the student name right here, if you click on it, you'll see three dots right here and we're going to show concluded enrollments down here. So now we see that um, in this case Cameron Fry was concluded and you were able to see his grade which is a zero percent but this is just a test class. But the one thing that you can't do is you cannot edit any of the grades. Uh, I think this is a more recent change because I think you used to be able to um, but the case is now you can't. So what we can do is then click on Cameron's name and then uh, go over here and then also click on his name up here and that will bring up a uh, user detail report for Cameron. And what you want to do is go down here where it says membership period one in this case. I'm going to click restore and now his enrollment is uh, restored. I can go to grades and then I should be able to go into Cameron's grade and then you know put any scores that I need to enter in here. So you can see that that is now working and his grade has been changed. Um, for us at Huntington Beach Union High School District um, the enrollment states are synced every night so uh, if it doesn't bother you to have Cameron um, active in your course for you know 24 hours or less you can simply um, let it go um, but if you want to have Cameron concluded again after you make these changes right away um, you can go back click on Cameron's name go over here and then click conclude okay otherwise it will just automatically be concluded um, with our nightly sync with our ARIES enrollment process. Hopefully this helps and uh, let me know if you have any other questions. Have a great day.